Hey coach, so happy you found us. Make sure you subscribe and like. Those are really important. Also, go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. If you want to win more games, have more fun and less time, let Teach Hoops do it. I have 30 years of coaching. I've been where you've been. I can help you in this process. Let me help you put banners and and, and uh, state titles in your gym. Let me help you do that. Go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. Let's head off to the video. Yeah. So what we do is we do a little half-court series that really kind of gets everybody going. And the kids don't love it, but it is very successful. It's a conditioning series that I love. I need two of you guys down here on the baseline. Just leave the ball off. You guys, come on over here. Can you give uh, Trevor on the ball? Thanks, Sam. Great. Now, we'll do a whole series of things. I'll put two players on a side basket, one on each side. You're going to be going off the backboard off the backboard with taps. Just straight up off the backboard here. You guys are going to be running a suicide right here. Now, if you've got another team practicing, great. You're going to run twice to half court. We'll go from half court. We'll just run them to half. You guys are going off the backboard. While this is going on, I'm going to have two more players. Um, Trevor, why don't you stay there? Why don't you come on over here? You're going to jump in here. I'll have two more players on the key. Now, we'll use a heavy ball, we'll use a big ball, anything, golf balls, tennis balls, something to make it interesting that they've really got to work their hands. Again, they're going to take it off the backboard here. We want to work on keeping that ball up nice and high. They'll backpedal out, they'll backpedal out every time to the foul line, they'll come in, get it off the board, jump up, little backboard tap, backpedal out. Now, the whole idea is to get you moving and working. Come on out. Jump you right in. Great. You in? Come on. On this side, we'll move somebody over here, and you can come up with a whole host of things. We do some heavy ropes. We do box jumping. You're going to come on over here, put you right here. All you're going to do is you're going to go hands over your head. You're going to jump up, side, back, side, little box jump. Okay? So now, this is all crafted and set up ahead of time. Where we could have a player over there doing ball handling. We'd have somebody else over here doing passing. If we've got to use, utilize the center jump, we take this center jump circle. I love making kids just jump in. Two feet, jump, land in the middle, jump out. Anything to get this started, to get practice going. So let's get, um, you're going to run the suicide by yourself. You're going to go on the backboard tap. Why don't you come on out, um, grab two balls, let's get you on the side doing a little ball handling. All of this is timed by the suicide, and this is prior to practice even getting started. This is our first thing. The kids walk into the locker room, everything's listed, who's going where. Let's get you with two balls right over here, right on the circle. All right. Two ball dribble. Um, you want to just take it around the legs, you can do that. Great. So you're going off the backboard, you're going off the backboard. Taps off the backboard and put it home. Okay, great with a heavy ball. If you've got a weighted ball, please make sure you keep your hands up. You don't want to catch that on your face. Not good to catch with your face. You're going to run the suicide. Okay, we'll rotate. You'll rotate over. You'll rotate to here. You'll go to the two balls. You leave those down. You'll rotate to the box. And you're going to rotate over there. Okay, and coaches can set this up any way you want. It's a series of stations. I love camp work. I love camp. I think station's the most important thing at camp. We can maximize our space and our time in practice by setting up a series of small stations. Your assistant coaches are out. I'd have an assistant over here making sure that every time he caught the ball, that ball stays up. Somebody's watching the suicide because he's my timer. He's got to be sprinting the floor. This man's got to make sure he keeps the ball over his head. If he's doing the tennis balls, he's got to make sure both hands are catching him. The ball handler, I have somebody on that side making sure the ball handler is doing his job, keeping his head up, not with his head down. All right? So, little box jump, little ball handle, you're going to go tap, you're going to go taps, bang it, and then back pedal out. Get all the way to the foul line and go. You're running the suicide. You good? All right, great. Here we go, fellas. What? Well, you're going to go foul line and back, half court back. Let's just go three, you know what? Go foul line and back, half court and back, and then we'll call it. Because we're just going to do this to show. All right, off the backboard, you ready? Go. Beautiful thing. Good. Back pedal out. Good. 
Nice, we're moving, we're moving. Good job, good job, good job. Okay, the suicide finishes. Now we put the balls down. Balls down, we switch. You rotate, rotate on a hop, on a hop, on a hop. Everybody's hopping, beautiful thing. And we pick it up and ready, go. Nice job, nice job, nice job. Head up on the dribble, good. Get those hands up, great. And we switch. Beautiful, one more time, one more time. Here we go. Good, on the move. Good, and touch. And we're up, and we're back pedaling out, back pedaling out, great. <coughs> Beautiful, great, good. Balls down here, let's take everything on the baseline. Now, we'll do as many as we need. Normally it's about six or seven stations. We'll set those up, and everybody's gonna run through once. This is my preseason stuff. We run it through early in the season. Once we start scrimmaging, I generally drop it, but it's a great way to start practice, get everybody's heart rate going. I just find it a lot better than running sprints, and sooner or later the kids are going to figure out, hey, we're using a basketball, but we're still doing the same amount of running. Yeah, well, you play basketball. This isn't the track team, it's a basketball team. Get a basketball and let's play with it. Hey coach, I uh, hope you're liking the video. If you are, hit like down below, that helps us a ton. Subscribe and hit that little bell. That little bell will give you a notification up above of every time that we go live. Also, go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better.